What it do, No Chefs? It's your boy, No Chef DJ, and my beautiful mom, Mama Bree. Before we get into this video, I want you guys to subscribe, like, hit the bell to be notified, and enjoy yourselves and live your life to the fullest, first and foremost, baby. So what I'm gonna bring to you guys today with Mama Bree is a taste test of some wines that we got today from Total Wine. If you guys saw in my last video I posted, I posted our shopping haul of going to Total Wine and get some things. I got some individual um, wines here. I got, um, and I'll post the pictures up here so you guys can see the label. Variation of the wines. So we got a Brut Champagne here. We got a Cantina Sangria here. Mm. We got a Coconut Sake, a Coconut and a Toasted Almond Sake. And then we got a Sweet Cherry Red mm. called Mad Crush. So we're gonna try these out and see what they are all about. Which one do you wanna start with? I wanna start with this one. The Mad Crush? Yep. All right, we'll start with that one. I'm gonna stab you. <laughs> well, you make it a uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I'm gonna yeah, drink it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do first and then you can taste it. We just taste it. Okay, we just taste it. Hmm. Not good. So sweet cherry is grape wine with natural flavors. Um, only thing about it, DJ. Get away. Only thing about it, DJ. What is she doing? Okay, take. It says, think back to your first crush. Yes, we remember our first taste of wine as well. Yeah, my first crush. First crush, crush tasted like this. That's just what it tastes like. <laughs> yeah, pretty basic. <laughs> Like something we don't really need to remember. Right. It's not bad though. It's not bad, but and this I has, wouldn't order it. This has 12% alcohol in it. Oh, I guess I'll be tipsy. Uh, 12.9% alcohol. Mama Bree don't drink, so she about to be tipsy. It's, it's not horrible. No, it's not. You know what? For a sweet wine, I'm not a big fan of sweet wines. This I, is not. On I the, like sweet wines. But this is on, on, not on the sweeter side of sweet wines, so. I actually like this, but I probably put some something else in it, like a little bit of Sprite to give it a bubbly. Mm -hmm. um, but at a, from a one to ten, I'll give this like an eight or yeah, seven. Yeah, I would too. All right, up next, which one are you want to try next? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna try the Cantina Sangria. I like sangria. Have you ever had sangria? I think I had one. This has ten percent alcohol. So basically, you just need one can of drink. The, the, it's, I like the that. smell is very fragrant. It smells like a soda from your childhood. I like that. That's good. That's, mm, the smell like smells that. almost like, like this smells more like your first crush, right? Like sweet a little bit? I like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Can I try it? Okay, thank you. Oh. That's me all day. That is you. It's super sweet, <laughs> but it's good. I like that. So you can keep that over there on your all right. right. Oh, you don't like sweet things. I'm not huge on sweet. I like a little, I don't like Well, I guess I'll be tipsy. Help. Send help. But at least I'm I'm with y'all. Yeah. She's safe and we're good and we're drinking responsibly, which is the most important thing to do, guys. If you're out there, especially during the holidays, please drink responsibly. Don't drink and drive. And None of that. and be just be safe. That's right. All right. Next up, what you want? What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Let's do that bottle. All right, so we're gonna pop some Brute Champagne. This is your basic Brute. It's by Rondell, never heard of him. Don't even know what that means. But I know it's a Brute Champagne, which is usually my favorite because it's a little sweeter. I don't like it, like, I don't like my champagne too dry. I'm gonna pop that right off. I was hoping it would pop, but you see it's smoking. Let's pour that on up. Oh yeah, that's bubbly. Can I say that it's really bubbly? Really bubbly. It looks like beer, don't it? Mm-hmm. But the bubbles go way, way faster than the beer. The beer, it does. Gosh, I All wish right, beer did guys. that. No, sir. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I know. I knew you was going to be a yes, ma'am. That's good. This, these would be good mixed, actually. No. So, last but not least is the... Toasted coconut almond sparkling sake wine. I don't want to forget this. I got you. And I have well, you have the video to come back to. Okay. And I have I took a picture of it too. So we're gonna pour this up, see how it looks when it's poured. So sake is Japanese. 
It's usually rice wine. I'm just gonna pour this whole thing because it's this is four percent alcohol and it's 88 calories and it's gluten free. So mm. that's good. Smell it. Ooh, I like the smell. It smells mm. like 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 a baked yeah. good or something. Mm -hmm. I think I like that too. You do? It's different. It's really, it's not bad. It isn't different. It's pretty good. It ain't sweet. But you get that almond and the coconut flavor. Mm -hmm. But it's not overpowering. It's mm -hmm. like a whisper. It's light, yeah. But it's good. But you can you can tell it's there. Okay, I would drink. I would for sure drink the sake and the brute for sure. These are the two. These and are the these two are I would drink. Two. These are my two. These are my two. So what's not in it is the Mad Crush. We could do without this, right? Yeah. The Mad Crush. We just kind of yeah. just like blah blah yeah, blah. Yeah. Let him go back. Yeah. Let yeah. him go with somebody else. Yeah. When um these two. When did you start drinking? When you were young. I didn't drink. You didn't drink. Mm -mm. Um, uh, well, I guess I used to taste my mom's beer. Yeah, you used to let us taste your beer. Yeah, too. I used to taste it when she didn't know, but she, I think she knew. But that's it. But you I let us probably, taste it willingly. Yeah, but I, I think I was probably like 13, 14, 15. Let me try this. That's, yeah, but I, I just never liked the taste of of, of liquor. Yeah, beer we used to sneak so. your um. Now I would drink a beer. I don't mind a beer, but I just me I'm and not... Love used to sneak and drink Dalvin's uh, Haitian rum underneath. Yeah, the see, scene. I don't, I don't. Yeah. Well, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like uh, a, a wine cooler. Is that what the Mac Crush tastes like? This one is really. Rashawn just tried it. This one and is, said this tastes like can, um, this, Wild Irish Rose. This uh, Cantina is. That's pretty good. Yeah. Well, I started drinking at my during the end of my first semester, my freshman year of college. I had. And the very first shot I had was a double shot of tequila that was given to me, and it was almost force fed to me by this girl in college at my like a, a dorm party. It was disgusting. That tequila was disgusting. Yeah, something. I mean, I, I guess I like sweet stuff. Yeah. I'm curious to but see how this tastes. But even just a here, little though. bit. I mean, just the two. Because this this isn't as sweet. This might cut it and give it a little bit more bubbly. Mm -hmm. That's perfect for me. So what I did was mix the Mad Crush with the Brute. Try it. You see what I'm talking about. You might not like it still because you like sweeter. I see what you're talking about. You see what I mean? It balances it out a little bit. Yeah, it does. Um, for those of you that don't know, I went to bartending school. Not that I have much to show for it, but I do know a little bit about a little bit about drinks and alcohol. So, um, and also, if you don't know, bartender's job is not to get you as drunk as possible. It's actually to, to keep you safe. So if you go out and the bartender tells you you're cut off, just listen. Because right. they're trying to keep you alive so that you don't cause a scene, get hurt, injure other people, or embarrass yourself. Oh, yeah. I'll buy that again. I wonder if they have it in a bigger pack. Most definitely. Like a six-pack. But one of these, Mom, will have you laid out. 10% in one thing. I'm going to be lit. <laughs> I'm gonna be Mama going to be lit. I'm going to be lit. It's okay. It's Saturday. We can get a little bit lit. Um, yeah, this this uh, this is all I need right so here. So overall, you you liked you liked all of them. Mm -hmm. there, was, there wasn't one that was like, no, oh, no, I'm not no, gonna drink no, that. No, no, all of them um, was pretty good. You 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 did good picking them out. So you guys can find all these at Total Wine, at least the one in Raleigh off Capitol Boulevard. But check this one out, y'all. Y'all, this, this is, is for the ladies. If y'all like a sweet drink that is good and it's ten percent alcohol, um, like I said, I'm not a drinker, but this I like the taste of this. This is like and it gives you a nice little Kool Aid buzz. almost. It's almost Kool Aid. -y. Well, you know, I'm tired of people calling the drinks that I drink Kool-Aid. Every, every time, everything I like, I, it's called Kool-Aid. Well, it's okay, Mom. I like it. Enjoy the Kool-Aid. Yeah, I like it. I as care. long as you're having a good time, who cares what everybody else says? I'm still going to say what I say to you. I don't, care, I don't care if it's Kool-Aid to y'all. I like Kool-Aid. Like, I like Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid gets you litty like a titty. I like Kool-Aid. All right, guys. I want to thank you for watching. Thank you. Mama, I'm, we miss y'all. <laughs> you guys have a good... You get just have just have a good life. <laughs> we'll see y'all again. Again, hit the bell to be notified. Subscribe and like this video. Y'all have a good day. Have a good night. Treat yourselves well and spread some love. Love y'all.